especially at the weekend, it's my moment to just sit for an hour before it. Victoria Beckham has given an explanation for why, at the 2000s peak of her career, she would often appear disinterested in photos taken by paparazzi. The entrepreneur became well known across the world for her singing career as the Distant Spice Girls member Posh and for maintaining a modest and clean image throughout the height of the media's fixation on her romance with football player David Beckham. Victoria, now 50, was rarely seen smiling in photos and was frequently seen using sunglasses and a poker face. She expressed her gratitude to social media for letting people see her more fun side. She gained notoriety last year when, in a Netflix episode of Beckham, she discussed her working-class upbringing and mentioned that her dad owned a Rolls-Royce. At her 50th birthday celebration, she led her band in a performance of the iconic song Stop, which further demonstrated her carefree nature. People can now see the real person thanks to social media, she said. I never set out to demonstrate to others that I was any different. Simply said, this is my identity. The fashion designer gave an explanation of why she avoided smiling on the red carpet earlier this year claiming that people frequently misinterpreted her facial emotions. She expressed her gratitude to social media for letting people see her more fun side. She gained notoriety last year when, in a Netflix episode of Beckham, she discussed her working-class upbringing and mentioned that her dad owned a Rolls-Royce. At her 50th birthday celebration, she led her band in a performance of the iconic song Stop, which further demonstrated her carefree nature. People can now see the real person thanks to social media, she said. I never set out to demonstrate to others that I was any different. Simply said, this is my identity. The fashion designer gave an explanation of why she avoided smiling on the red carpet earlier this year, claiming that people frequently misinterpreted her facial emotions. She told the Sunday Times, I was really struck by how happy I looked when I looked at some pictures of myself recently. I've always thought of myself as a nervous, insecure woman when I look at those red carpet photos of myself. She gave an explanation of why that wasn't a real reflection of her entire personality in a recent interview with The Times. I believe that for a very long time, people's perception of me was shaped by what they saw in photos taken by paparazzi, she stated. I didn't look very impressed quite a bit.